so hey guys welcome back to my channel simply stuff that's me so in today's video I'm also excited um <laughs> yeah sure I really am excited um as you can tell by the thumbnail we already know what it's about and it's what I have right in here and if you want to see oh my gosh what I had to go through to get ooh, that little pop there what I had to go through <laughs> to get this video to you guys then please keep on watching hey guys please re remember to subscribe if you have not rate the video thumbs up and turn on the bell so you're notified each and every time I upload thank you okay guys so again welcome back to my channel boy did I have a heck of a time with this video I literally did three separate looks at three different times and tried to put it into one video and oh my god I have recorded this this will I think this is take four I do need one of those things that come down in the movies like take four <laughs> because I kept deleting the footage and we could not figure out what was going on now my boyfriend did look at the the, the camera the app that I was using that I always use um and he fiddled with it and god willing this will go up so if you want to see what this is all about I will quickly open up and show you this is the Jeffree Star launch and I'm also oh excited because your girl here loves a good mat I do I love mats I love creating looks with mats I mean I like shimmers too but if given my choice I would probably do a matte look I, I think I would lean more towards a matte so anyway here is the packaging okay it looks like this and here is the palette which is exactly the same it has um, Jeffree Star up close and personal and I do need personal now um, I will go ahead and show you it does come with a mirror okay hang on I don't want to mess the shades up but you know me and thinking them all the time okay so it does have a mirror okay I'm just gonna go ahead and hold that down and then here we have the shades okay I'm peeking around the corner here but there we have all the shades okay now there is this is a 30 pan palette okay it does have all of your neutral shades okay different undertones and guys I don't know my undertones but I do know in my opinion if you have this you'll probably never have to reach for another like brown tone palette or neutral palette if that's what you want to call it um it, it like i said it does have different undertones um yeah so this is the this is 62 dollars, which i was not disappointed in the price i really thought it was going to be a lot more than that okay only because it has 30 uh 30 different shades and it's all matte so i don't know if that makes it harder or easier to make but again all different kinds i mean you can totally go to town with this palette and create a look with just this or you can go ahead and incorporate the other part of his collection a small part of it anyway because the collection was quite big I however was only able to get this and I was able to get the mini which looks like this okay again it's the mini orgy you have bodies everywhere which I don't mind looking at um, not too much anyway I'll be sleeping but he, I set it in front of him anyway but um, this is always hard to get out it's a little snug in there okay so this is what it looks like on the packaging outside when you take it out it is totally different okay which was a little bit surprising but again I mean you know maybe it's better that it's not bodies everywhere but you still do have the word and then it does come with a mirror let me take this off and then you have all shimmers it's a, it's nine pin of shimmers okay again neutral shimmers that go with all the mats in here and you can use just about any shimmer in here I was looking at it very closely you can pretty much use any shimmer with any combination of mats in the big palette so you know I mean my personally I don't think I'll ever buy a neutral palette again unless it's like something you know I don't know I can't say never but I don't need to I really feel I personally don't feel that I have to but anyway oh enough talking let me see I'm hoping that I salvage some footage um, 
of me putting on this look because like I said I recorded three different looks and then well four total if you want to say this look right here this one was done twice okay so I'm hoping this is the first one I ever did and then I did other ones but I lost the footage hoping to pull something from my gallery I, it's got to be backed up somewhere and we just can't find it that was a problem so this video will be done on Sunday but probably late so I want to put it up Monday morning and please by all means I want you to be on the lookout for a second video on Monday, okay? Um, because I, I don't want to make this super long. I'm already talking for four minutes. And Lord knows how much footage I was able to salvage as far as the look is concerned, okay? So I, I know I am going probably to zoom you in or whatever and uh, create one eye and then do the rest off camera. Um, hopefully I'll have something afterwards. I'm not sure, but we will see, okay? So... There you have it. This is the Jeffree Star Mini and the big guy. So if you want to see how I got this look right here, then by all means, and you want to see what kind of craziness I had to go through, then um, please keep on watching. Okay, guys, so we are really going to try. I, I apologize if nothing is centered, but honestly, this is, and I can't, three times I've had to film this, and... Uh, trying to upload it. I've been for three days trying to upload this video. I had to take my makeup off and restart over because I kept losing the footage. Every time I was trying to put the little pieces to, together to make a long, cohesive video, that's called exporting, I was losing it. I, I kept deleting. I don't know why, but anyway, my boyfriend took a really good look at the camera and hopefully this works. I'm hoping you'll see this one. <laughs> Please, I can't do it again. So anyway, I do have the palette, I do have my brushes, all clean, yes, thank you, and I do have a new set. Let's get this out of the way over here. Now, I am going to be using a mirror right here, so if you see me looking down, I apologize. Um, I don't, I'm not very good at holding the palette and, and using the mirror, but um, I have absolutely no room to work on my dresser as usual. What else is new, right? So we'll put everything on this side. Oh my gosh, there goes the mirror. Like I said, I hope I'm not bumping into the camera because that would just oh so suck. Okay, so. <laughs> all right, so I do. Oh, and don't, like I said, uh, I have lotion. That's why you see the white little spots under my eyes because your girl's eyes are way too dry for powder. I repeated myself. This did come in the thing with it. Now, I didn't even take a look at it. This is, uh, what is this? I don't know what this is. <laughs> Soothing, clean sensitive something or other I don't know it's a little sample that came in I got my order from Beautylish and I really thought it was going to be oh so hard so I have primed my eyes with the Urban Decay priming potion as usual and a little bit of Kaylin um, dropping brushes that wouldn't be me if I didn't drop the brushes so let's put it here this way and hopefully I can be able to do this and I don't want to keep on blinding you but now I'm going to see if I can recreate the look I did the first time because I really like that one. Okay, so I am going to, let's see, what am I looking for? A big fluffy brush, which is my, no, where's my Moda? Oh, telling you, I should have laid them out. I should have just grabbed them. Here we go. Here it is right here. Sorry, guys. So this is the, I can't read it. Oh, and I did have my new glasses with me, but this is the, um, BMX 430 it's the Moda 430 so let me go ahead and I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna dust all over my lid the shade silk robe which is like where is it it's right here right there <laughs> okay so we're gonna try that let's see and I don't you know I don't usually see a lot of well there is some kick up in, in the pan I will say that I've been seeing that with a lot of the shadows okay so I'm just all the way just taking that and I'm dusting it all over like always or like the one time I've done it I'm gonna do one eye off camera and then I will come back and do the other okay so now that we have that laid down I'm gonna set that here because I'm gonna have to use it again there's the, it's gonna roll off I know it is okay so we're gonna I want to take my Sigma and um, if I can find it I was so mad I washed my brushes and I was like please let them be dry and they are okay so I'm going in with my, this is the Sigma, um, which one is it? Oh, gosh. I don't know. I don't know why this doesn't say, uh, the other ones absolutely do say it on there. 
And oh, I, you know what? I think I washed it off. Of the E25, this is like a crease brush, so uh, like a fluffier crease brush. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to take, let's see, which one did I use before? I don't remember. Okay. Um, 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 um. I'm going to use top, which is right here, this this shadow right here, okay? I'm going to go ahead in and I'm going to put that in my crease only because top off the extra. And I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to put that in there. I hope you guys can see me. I've got you zoomed in. This is more of a brownie. Like I said, I love, look, I, this, these shadows, I'm telling you guys, they blend out. Oh, my God. Do I have to say it? it's Jeffree Star formula? Oh, look at me. I was going to do the other eye. Okay, so no. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to lay that down. Now, I always come up just a little bit because of my hooded eyes. I try and bring that shadow up just a little tiny bit above so that you can see it when I look forward. Okay. And I'm working down here with this mirror right here. Again, hopefully you can see it. And I know I'm not centered in. Oh, don't fall. There go the brushes. Sorry. <laughs> okay, so... Let's turn the mirror here so I can absolutely see it. I do have that mirror, not that round one. The round one's behind there. That's what I'm looking at past the camera. But hopefully, by me looking in the camera, you guys can see I'll sit up straight. The top of my head is cut off. I still apologize. I just threw my hair back real quick. Okay, so you see how we have that. And it is a bit diffused. I just wanted to lay it down, okay? And I will absolutely go in with the... Um, I'm shy shade and like buff that out to even get more of a gradient. Okay, so there we go there. And I'm going to pull that down just a little bit right here. Okay. Now, I think I might pop a shimmer on the inside of my lid. But I don't know if I'm going to use that palette. I'm not sure. Because I don't know what I'm going to do with that palette yet. I, I might, I probably will, but I, I keep, I say things and then I'm like, oh, and now guys, I always do, when I run my, my transition shade, I go windshield wiper motions, okay, and I do usually bring it all the way into the corner, and sometimes when I'm working on that outer corner, I will lift it up just a little bit because as you, they haven't really gone down, they're just straight, they used to go up, believe it or not, when I was a kid. Okay, so there's that one. I'm going to keep that for the other eye. Now, I want to go into my crease, directly into the crease with, if I can find the right brush, where are you? Where are you? There it is. No, that's a little too big, I think. Let's see. Okay, here we go. This is the, a doe color brush, and they do not have the numbers on them, but it's this oh, little teeny tiny thing, if you can see that. Oh, oh right, right there you can. Okay. So... I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to deepen up that inner corner, or I mean the inner crease with, what's that called? Oh, Craving Chocolate, okay? Which I think that's going to be a little bit of brown shade. Let's try, oh no, I don't want to say that word. Okay, um, let me try all night long. No, I'm so undecided. Yeah, let's try Versatile, okay? And that shade is right here, okay? If you guys can see, I'm going in right here, Versatile. Okay, and I'm just going to put ever so slightly and see if I can't get it. Now I'm going directly into the crease area right here. And I always keep my eye open so that I can see what other people can see when I'm looking at them. All right, that's the reason I do that. Just tap my brush off a little bit. And again, so you can see how, again, we've got that gradient thing going on. Oh, I like these shadows are so nice. I'm so excited that I got this palette. Okay, so that's just a little bit in there. All right, now I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to take a... Let me see, where is it? Oh, that little denser brush that I had. And that one... I have a little angled brush here. Excuse me, my nose is... Right. Always when I'm with the round shadows. I don't know what it is. Okay, so I have a little, a little angled brush there, if you can see it. This is just one of the Luxie brushes we got in BoxyCharm. And I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to out, uh, deepen up that outer corner. Excuse me for my runny nose. Now, I'm going to, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into Mon Money Shot, which is right here. This shadow right here. One, two, three. Fifth row, first shadow, Money Shot. Okay. And then I'm going to go ahead and tap that off. And I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to deepen up that outer corner. Okay. Now, the good thing that I've noticed, since this is the third look that I'm doing, 
Um, with these shadows, guys, you absolutely, they just go with each other. Even though, like, there's different shades and different undertones and everything, you can make them work. I know, listen, I don't know my undertones. I don't know my, you know, anything except that's color. I, I like that color. That's, that's what I know. So I'm going to go ahead and, again, just a little, very pigmented, just the littlest tap of the brush. And look, I've got that color payoff I want right there. And what I will do is I will bring it just a little bit in since it's a tapered brush. I will take it, what's left on the brush, and I will run it in like I always do to about, I want to say, maybe maybe halfway to the lid. Okay, and you see here now, I don't worry about being like symmetrical because I will buff everything out when I'm done. I just wanted to deepen that corner up. And these shades, I'm telling you guys, they're oh so nice. Uh, okay. So there we have that, right? Now, let's play with some sugar. I mean, look how easy that was. Three shades. Now I will, like I said, I will, you'll see. <laughs> I'm going to reach behind me and grab the palette. Now I have the shimmers right here. I'm going to go ahead and use them because why not? I didn't use them before. That's the thing. I, I was seeing something. But now that I have them in front of me, I am going to go ahead in. And now what I want to do is I want to take, I'm going to do, again, a gradient, like from light to dark. So I'm going to go ahead and um, I think I'm going to start with this shade right here. And I'm going to pop, oh no, I'm sorry. I'm going to, this uh, gagging. <laughs> right here in the corner, right here top row. I'm gonna to go ahead and use that. I hope you guys can see that. I'm just gonna use my finger ever so gently on, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, guys, look at that, wow. And that's just the littlest swipe. I didn't even hardly wreck the star, look at that. And that's, okay, well maybe we need to put a little more on it, okay. And I'm gonna go ahead, and I'm gonna run that about a third of the way in, almost to the, I usually take it to the beginning of my um, color of my eye, what's that called, pupil? <laughs> um, yeah, so let's try that. Now I know that if I wet this brushes, I don't know where my wipes are, so excuse me for wiping my hands. Where are, where's that little flat brush I had? <laughs> let's see, I absolutely know, well I don't know, but I'm guessing if it's anything, you know, staying in line with your star, that if I wet this brush, where is it? I'm going to have to take them all out. Look pretty crazy because I know it's just here it is. Okay. I always use oh, that's not, this one. I always use this brush to wet because it is on an angle. It does. I do have a little bit of an angle going on there. You see that? And it's very, very flat. So I use this to try and pick up the... Um, shimmers okay so hang on one second let me go ahead and get the spray Where is it? Uh, okay is that the one I wanted no no here it is. Oh, everything's falling I'm telling you I, I can't tell you how sore my eyes were that that other night when I was trying to film okay so I'm just gonna go ahead and spray the brush a little bit okay and then I'm gonna go ahead and, and pick up again um, gagging and see what we can do if it comes up a little bit oh my gosh wow. I'm not doing a cut crease because that's just very time consuming so okay there you have that now I'm gonna take my little color switch because let's see we can get that to pop just a little more look at that I am dying how close are we can we see that I mean oh oh forgive me for looking down but okay there we go now you can absolutely do a cut crease with this and I think that I will I have that remember I said I have that one palette that I want to do five looks with and I'm definitely going to be doing a cut crease so what I'm going to do is I want to I want to run a little bit of a darker shade on the outer corner and then a more medium shade on the middle and I'm going to see maybe I might not be able to do that I might be only only to do the two so I'm going to go ahead and pick up 
the shade Eiffel Tower, which is right here, okay? This is a shimmer, but it's almost the same color as this one, so it's just going to give it a little pizzazz, I guess you could say. Oh, yeah, look at that. Oh, my goodness. Wow. And this is an even wet brush, guys. Holy crap. Oh, now I do have fallout, but that's okay because I only have moisturizer on. I didn't even put my foundation on yet, so I have a, a little bit of tinted moisturizer. Okay, so there we have that. Now I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to run my finger again right here, and I'm going to pull that shade all the way over like that. Okay, and then always what I do, so there's not that heavy, oops, let me go ahead and try and brush off this. I, I really went heavy with that. That was my fault totally because I really went heavy. Now, like I said, you see how it gets on my eyes? It doesn't matter because when I take a wet tissue, I just take a wet tissue and I wipe away the, lay, the top layer and it always comes off. The lotion almost kind of melts it off, so I never have a problem with that. So let's go ahead and... I really dug my brush in there. I didn't even need to. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to go ahead and I always wiggle right where the two meet. That just kind of gives it a more... So it doesn't have like such harsh lines there. Let me just put a little more up here. I'm going to go ahead and add that like that. And I think what I'm going to do is... Again, run my finger here and you can do it either way you can take the white and put it on top of the dark or vice versa now just want to get one more thing and then I will go ahead and blend this out and then I will hop off camera and what I'm going to do is I'm gonna take a little bit of this just the ever so little bit and pop it over all of it I think hubby's here, so if you hear anything, that's him coming in. Okay. Okay. Gonna, I mean, the ever littlest bit. And I'm just going to go ahead and... Just so you can still see the color underneath it, okay? I, I, I'm, I'm tipping my head, and I apologize. I hope you guys can see. Let's see. I'm, I'm trying to peek around the camera. That's not working. Anyway, so we have that. Now, let me go ahead... And I'm going to go ahead and try, oh, I need a big fluffy brush, which here we have right here, one of my doe color ones. Now, and don't, like I said, don't worry about the fallout. I can just really wipe that off. You see, the lotion, it just kind of wipes off. Now, of course, I did make a mess. <laughs> I need to wipe my fingers off before I do that, but okay. So I'm going to go ahead and buff this out just a little bit. Now, remember I said I always like to bring it up just a little bit right here. Let me use this mirror so I can see. It almost looks like I'm looking at the camera. <laughs> Sorry for looking down, guys. Okay. Now, see, I'm just diffusing that color right here a little bit to go up, okay? And what I will do is I will take that brush that we used on the first color right here, and I will go ahead and... I'm sorry, second color. My bad. <laughs> and then I will just go ahead and add a little more I'm not adding anything to the brush what I'm doing is I'm just bringing it up ever so slightly because remember I said I don't like how it just stops and then it's flesh I always like to try and Ooh. now I haven't added anything to these brushes guys at all okay now if I want to add just a little more darkness out here on the outer corner bring it out just a little more all I have to do is tap that brush on there, and you see, I've already done a little bit of a shadowing there. Let's see, what do I want to use? Do I want to use this? Yeah. Nope. Let's use... Where did I go? I'm getting confused. Too many brushes got me confused. Okay, here we go. <laughs> so, again, I'm just going to tap up, and there we have it. And again, and then it's just a matter of adjusting. That's what I do. I get it laid down, and then I go ahead and blend it out. And this, I mean, guys, you could wear this to the office. You could wear it anywhere, really. And if you really, really want to, like, jazz it up, then you could go ahead and, I mean, with the shimmers, you can add, like, a little bit of color. That pink, that pink is calling my name. Definitely have to use that. I definitely have to. Um, maybe not in this video, but, yeah. 
Now I'm just going to run a little bit more here in the inner corner. And I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to take that angled brush that I have, a little skinny one, and I'm going to take a little bit of the first shade on the, in the, oh, did I just, oh, I just dug a hole in it. No, I didn't. Yes, I did. Just a little one. Um, it's called Glass Wet, this one right here. Just ever so little bit and pop it right here on the inner corner. Now, again, there is fallout here, but it shimmers. And you know me, I'm so messy. When Listen, I don't care if the palette is the best palette in the world. Guess what, guys? <laughs> I'm going to get fallout for sure. Okay, so there you have it. And there I'm just running over. I just wanted to do that to give it just a little bit more, like right, right here, more, more so than anything. And you can still see the colors that you've laid down. Okay, let me hop off camera. I will go ahead and, like I said, clean up this, take off the um, excess. And again, all I'm doing is I just... And buffering up, I will put some uh, highlight, the white shade, what's it called? Glass wet <laughs> up onto um, my brow bone. Okay, guys? So hang on and I'll be right back. Okay, guys, so there you have it. There's the look. Um, I'm kind of zoomed in still. I'm going to zoom you back out um, to show you everything, the whole collection and everything. And... Um, that's it. I mean, it was real simple. I, I, I'll i get to my final thoughts about the palette, but um, there you have it. Oh, and I, by the way, I do have my new glasses, so yay. Um, where are they? I can't find them, but anyway, they're here. Um, so yeah, so again, we have the Jeffree Star collection. And I have to, do I get like in trouble if I say the word orgy palette and the orgy collection? We got the mini and we have the big one. So that's how I did this look. And okay, so let me zoom you back out and I'll give you my final thoughts. Hang on. Hey guys, so there you have it. That was the whole finished look. Um, I'm hoping that I was able to put something together at least comprehensive enough for you guys to see how I created. And by the way, I do have my new glasses, yay! What do y'all think? Comment below, do you like them or do you like my old, my other ones better? And these guys, I can actually wear with big lashes and they're not really in the way. These are my old ones. Oh, they're so scratched up. Oh, anyway, um, again, the Jeffree Star palette, the mini, well, sorry, here we go. Let's do like this. This is the mini, there's the carton, okay. It has bodies everywhere and when you open it up it looks like this and I am loving this collection I knew he, I just had I knew he was gonna come out with one I just knew it I knew it I knew it I knew it I'm gonna take these off right real quick I do have some boxes that I have to get through they came oh so late but that'll be for another day and um, please be on the lookout because I don't want to uh, put it in this video only because it'll be so long I'm afraid y'all won't watch it. So I'm going to put a separate video up. And you guessed it, I'm having a giveaway. Now, I wasn't able to get this palette at the same time. Um, I will, however, have it. But for now, the next, videos, ugh, the next video you see will be indicative of Jeffree Star. Okay, so please keep your eyes out for that. And make sure you watch the video all the way through, guys. All the way through. That's just a heads up, okay? Not that you don't, but... Just pay attention as much as you possibly can. And yeah, so thank you for watching. I am loving the fact that I just want to say hello to all the newcomers. We have many newcomers here and um, welcome to the family, guys. I'm so glad that you're here. I also want to say thank you to our Kansas gals for unboxing the prize that she won from me. And because of that, a, a ton of her subscribers were able to... to you know, they came over and checked me out, and they are now part of the family. And I, again, want to say welcome to you guys. Thank you so much for taking a chance on me and on the channel. Um, until I see you in the next one, guys, please remember, if you're not feeling right or you're just out of sync, please pick up the phone and call someone. Hit me up on IG. I'm always available. I will love chatting with you guys. That's how I get to know you. Um, also, if you have something that you have not said to a loved one and, you know, you're waiting for that right moment, don't. Because you never know, you know, um, 
life is short and I know it's a sad thing but it's true very very true um, and but most of all out of everything that goes on in this world the main thing is please stay safe see you guys bye